the audio levels on this one. So this game is called Nevermind. Okay, Steam sale was good to me. Let's do in stream recording. something a little calmer, a little more mellow, less driving, just butterflies, incense and peppermints, good times, never mind. This brightness level is okay. I can see all the things on the logo. Calm game, calm video game, beginning now. shit. <laughs> well, you're ugly people. Opening day. Neurostalgia founders and elite employees greet clients and staff on the Institute's first day publicly open. Ha! To the future. The Neurostalgia Institute's founders and staff are dedicated to seeking out the best care options for each individual client. Look at these awards. We've won shit. Yeah. Look at the shit we won. The Changing Times. That's a real newspaper. Milestones. Vincent D'Onofrio. Uh, creepy dude. Dwight Bishop. That's a creepy name. Oh, hey, how are you? That's a gelfling. Okay, uh. Respect. Okay. Oh, hey, look at this. I turn right, I get audio out of my right ear. I turn left, I get audio out of both ears. Ugh. Service guarantees citizenship. Would you like to know more? I'm a neuroprober, guys. <laughs> That's what she said. Uh... Yep, going to the subconscious. Terms of service? Fuck that shit. Click agree and go. Oh, shit. Okay, uh, first name. What's my first name? Help, what's my first name? Ooh. Brock is a good name. Okay, my name is Brock. What's my last name? Brock Z oh, Okay, Brock Zapfist is the best name. I will go into your mind and punch your fears. Fuck yes. <laughs> I stalled ya. <laughs> ah, marketing. Uh... 
Highlight by the lens, first day registration, okay. Nostalgia lens, ba ba. Okay, I'm gonna go in this dude's fucking brain and catch Pokemon, y'all. We got this. I move slow as shit. Dr. Mariantina Gostas, Bradley Munn, David Aller, Simak Bahaska? Fucking Star Trek villain. DNT Sontek? That's not a name! Ooh, fuck. ZZ Fan. Yes! Oh, these are totally, like, Kickstarter backers, aren't they? Oh! More Kickstarter backers. These are totally Kickstarter backers. Congratulations, Zini Dimitrio. You have been recognized. <laughs> Precha. Precha Metharam. Who the fuck kickstarted this? Ukulele Windship? Oh, fucking Quelock! I wanna go in Quelock's mind. Staff only. That's me. Hell yeah! <laughs> I'm not playing anymore. I'm just staying here and staring at this. I have made it, y'all. I have made the big time. Fuck yeah, this is my office, yo. Brock Zapfist. Ham punch game. I don't know, but... Why are you red? Why are you a red door? <laughs> okay, handbook. What's the handbook? Uh, I'm not drinking. Trauma! I know what trauma is. I'm a doctor of punch fisting. I'm a doctor of science fisting. I don't care. I'm going into your brain and punching your brain with my science fists. Okay. Intro sim. That's not a name. That's not a person. Okay. Let's try intro sim. That, okay. Ah. Also, you all dropped the ball. I really should be Dr. Zap Rousedower. So, I blame you. I want to rub my face on those. Hello? Oh shit, nigga. Why did I smoke? What's going on? Oh god. I'm tripping balls. Oh god. The intro sim is a single. Things have become almost unbearable for me and for my family nothing has helped i guess that's why i'm here uh so um if i just talk about my troubles you'll be able to use it later to help with the procedure i'll use this giant it's fucking microscope lens to help you i guess I, 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 I don't know why a microscope will help my your brain but sure when i was young so why don't we start with my childhood days yes Okay. Okay. Let's see. 
I was raised in a lovely cottage in rural Germany. Ah, uh, Germany. We didn't have much, but my twin I did not totally pick up on the fact that you were raised in mine. Germany. There was actually a great famine for much of my oh. early childhood, and often we oh went God, without Oh God, please food. let this guy's name be Hansel. I had many happy moments with my family. Hansel. But the darkest times began when my father remarried. My stepmother Hansel. always resented my sister and me. We didn't like her much either, to be honest. God, she was horrible. Sometimes she would take my sister and me out for long walks in the forest, and then she'd this hurry This is gonna home. turn to a fucking my Hansel and, and Gretel reference, keep isn't up. it? We'd this is to- I nailed, nailed it. We this learned is Hansel and Gretel. We learned trail of whatever we could find on those walks to help us get home. I guess, in some ways, our stepmother helped us become resourceful. Life was hard when my grandfather died my in the camps. A real fighter. He the kind of woman in the watchtower and fell out. Look up to. She volunteers to work with various youth organizations now. Okay. Anyway, enough about her. Okay. What else? Maybe I should talk about my feelings. I love the chocolate. You may find it. Hard <laughs> to do, I've always struggled with various eating Nailed it! Nailed it! Anxiety around food. Nailed it! Eating anything. Holy quick, shit, I nailed it! Scared and anxious. And oh my god! I am the best! My sister has actually I am the best of video games! And it has worsened for us both as we've gotten older. That's not normal, though, is it? We've seen countless doctors about this in the past. They've determined that our issues may be trauma-related, but have yet to help us sort out the underlying source. We have given you an envelope with a brain on it, because that's not at all fucked up. Fix us. That's why we're here. Okay, uh, so... Yep, yeah, okay, uh, cookies, I guess. Damn, I'm good at this shit. <laughs> I want to punch the fucking crazy out of your brain, man. I got this. I got this shit. Listen to Welcome guidance. to Neuroprober training. I am pleased to be your guide. When I'm speaking, you can always make a right-click motion to skip this instruction. Why am I being talked to by a you are here Google Maps image? Welcome to Neuroprober training. Whatever. I am pleased to be your guide. When I'm speaking, you can always make a right-click oh, motion Jesus, to skip the hell are you? Whether you are speaking with the client directly or neuroprobing within their mind, it is always imperative. Bitch, to I don't need to listen. I'm Dr. Zap Brock Fist, bro. Trying to Fuck tell you. Story. In the case of our clients, it's often the forgotten story of the trauma they experienced. See these flowers? The I will punch these flowers out of your damn brain. Or corrupted by the conscious mind's attempts to reconcile or cover up the truth of what happened to them. However, if you look closely and carefully in the right places, you will find that the truth will ultimately shine through. Some parts of the subconscious allow you to interact with them, while neural what the hell is this? make a left-click motion to engage with it. Holding on to right click will allow you to move the item around to examine it further. When you are done. Yo, I found your problem. You got fucking bread in your brain, dude. Okay, so I can't save the bread, I guess. There's bread in your brain, yo. Oh shit, man. You got a boat. You got a boat in your brain. Oh, hell no. Got cupcakes on the mind. Okay, so let's solve this. He's got a, he's got bread, a boat, and a cupcake. What do all these things have in common? Shit, I don't know. Dot, 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 dot. Five dots. Blank five dots. Okay, whatever. Can I move your dots? I guess not. While neural probing, you will encounter objects that look like photographs. 
This is how your consciousness interprets the concrete memory moments. Are there are no photographs here. Oh, hey, a photograph. Typically, there are about ten of these memory photos <laughs> found in. Ah, uh, look at this photograph. The mind can hold on to only oh, so much. Every time I do it, makes You'll me find laugh. That half of these photos present an actual moment relating to the trauma. The other half tend to be false memories created by the client's conscious mind. My stepmother it will hated. Be up to you to shut up. Which are which. My twin. Shut up. More on that later. Shut up, Google. My stepmother hated my twin sister and me. Okay. <gasps> it's on the thing. When you acknowledge a memory photo, it will surface more prominently in the client's psyche, and at that point can be found in a safe area of the mind. Often, where you begin within the client's mind. When you, you have found often your brain, or she, man. that breakthrough is what every neuroprober lives for. And Dear Brock, go away. To work towards true Love recovery. your stepmom. This woman hates sausages. Okay. The most important thing <sighs> you do what? as a neuroprober is Fuck find you. Go and away. acknowledge these photos. However, this is easier said than done. I can't While walk some through the bushes. are freely available in the subconscious. Others are buried deeply within and will need to be coaxed out. I really don't care, man. Just show me your show me your pictures. What the hell's going on here? Okay, uh doors. This is a door, that's a door. I can't go through any doors. Okay, notice everything. Look at everything. Interact with the world. Look at this damn ship. Look at it! Look at the boat! Okay. Cupcake. Cupcake. Okay. I have interacted with the things. I have looked at everything. What have you got for me? <gasps> Another picture! Wait, was this here already? Did I miss this? We'd often eat rabbit stew. I don't bet that's real. That feels like a real thing. Okay, more pictures? Oh, what's going on? Oh, hey, hey, pictures. Your pictures. I need more pictures. Zach, I still don't have enough clues. Too much noise. We can't profile just yet. This game is boring. I want to punch brain damage. Oh, you're a door. Interacting with one part of the mind can sometimes open up new areas of the psyche. Some things, like these doors, can change their state in response to actions taken elsewhere. That's great. Thank you for. Oh, hey, look a picture. My sister saved me from becoming- that's a lie. That's not real. That didn't actually happen. The subconscious doesn't take kindly to intruders, and will take every opportunity to feed off of any sensations of anxiety or tension you offer to it. If you can, try to stay calm and peaceful, I even in the face no... of terror. Please. If you can calm yourself, <sighs> you'll find the subconscious will calm itself too. Serenity now. I fear nothing. I am the mind killer. I am the tiny death. I've got this. We're good. We're good. We're good. Nothing will scare me. I shall face my fear, and in facing it... Here is an example of an especially buried memory. Some details of a given trauma can be especially tenacious, but by gently and cleverly listening to the clues the mind gives you, you will find all you need to work through it. Just think of it as a puzzle for you to solve. When you focus on these puzzles, make a right-click motion if you need to break your concentration. A right-click motion. Okay, well... Uh, Jesus. Rock! Help me, Rock. Save me, Rock. Oh, fucking Rock. Okay, what do we got going on here? You're a bird! You're a bird. You're a thing. What can I do? How can I interact with you? <gasps> a 
Okay, you have a thing, and you have a thing. <gasps> a thing happens! Nailed it in one! I am the best! I am the brain puncher! The birds would never sing for us. Hell yeah! God damn it, I am the brain surgeon! Open door! For I am the best. Really? Okay. Door. Whoa! <laughs> ha! What the fuck are you? Nope. I'm gonna nope my way right through here. Uh, uh, where's my exit? Uh, what's happening, man? This ain't cool, yo. What is actually happening right now? Blair Witch shit right here. Okay, uh, so you're a route, uh, you're a route, and you're a route. There are multiple routes here. Yes, I found another route. For I am. <laughs> what? I don't. Okay, maybe that actually happened. I don't know. I'm gonna go punch cancer now. While neuroprobing, your consciousness is lost deep inside the subconscious Holy mind. Holy God! Talk time. about breaking the While mood. this is a journey that you must make alone, well, it just we at the Neurostalgia the moment, Institute man. take the safety of our neuroprobers very seriously. You just if totally you to ruined this whole possibly scary. Tools, shut or up! Pull your consciousness free. Press your finger where an escape key might be. Oh my god, this shut will bring up, up Dr. Exposition. Tools, and you can proceed as needed from there. That's not tools, that's the that's the exit. Oh fuck you! Fuck you! You are the worst. What do I have to do this? Oh! I have all the things! Let us solve the puzzle! Let us figure out how this works. Okay, what does this work? What happens? Talk to me, man. Okay. This is real. How does this wait okay what do I do wait you're not you're not a thing that's working for me right now handbook uh, trauma what do you got treatment this is useless thank you thanks for that okay how do I solve this okay acknowledge the memory photo when you acknowledge a memory photo it will surface more prominently in the client's psyche, and at that point can be found in a safe area of the mind, often where you begin within the client's I'm reading mind. the chat! How dare when you? you have found all ten photos, you must put five of the memories that actually represent the trauma in the proper order. Doing so will oh, it's fully a, release uh, the memory to the client's uh, conscious mind. I have to find five more? Often he or she will experience a breakthrough at this moment. That breakthrough is what every neuroprober lives for. 
and is the key to the client finally being able to work towards true recovery. Well, how good is it that everyone who has a brain problem has exactly 10 memories, I guess, whatever. I'm reading the chat. I'm totally reading the chat. I see your chat. Where should I go now to find five more memories? Okay. I need five more memories. I can't open this door again. This door is blocked. As is this door. As is this door. Okay, that's not good. Bread, boat, cupcake. Why is that significant? What door? How would I open the door? The door does not open. There is nowhere to go. Okay, where is the open door? Oh, that door. Thank you. Fucking really? Do you remember when I mentioned that the client's subconsciousness can feed off of your fear? Fuck you! Some especially vulnerable areas can be very sensitive and dangerous. When you place your consciousness in another Fuck subconsciousness, you. Fucking sell there is a risk shit of right you here. getting hurt, of the pain and turmoil of the client's subconscious drawing your own mind into its agony. You must be brave in these areas, despite the risk. You must stay calm. Should you let your fears get the best of you, it will be incredibly difficult to proceed unharmed. Oh, no fucking really. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. You can even pick up and walk around with some objects. Oh my god, so much so, tutorial. Interact with it and then start walking while holding on to it. What do I have to hold on to? Fine, I've got a rock. Yay, rock. Look, I have a rock. I'm going to place the rock. Or bread. I don't even know anymore. I have given the creepy owl the bread. Whatever. Ah! Oh, you. There, I have placed the thing. Puzzle is solved. Can I leave now? A bridge! I have found the bridge. The bridge is found. What the fuck am I hearing? Fuck it. The fuck are you? God damn it. That is not helpful. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, that's not at all not ominous. I'm doing this wrong.
God fucking damn it, Schroeder. Zach, that too, too. It says love G. Okay. Um. Fuck. Wait, I came across that bridge already. This bridge is. I, I found that bridge. This bridge is past. I should not go back across the bridge. Fucking sheep. Okay, we're good. We got this. We are solving the puzzle. So, G, uh... Okay, I assume one of those was G. Okay, come on. Yes, piano. Oh shit, what did I find? What are you? I need to give you f ah, food for you, whatever you are. Have a rock. But it's not a rock. It's a rock lobster. That solve the things? Is this puzzle solved? Is this puzzle solved now? This is new. God damn it! I have to pick up that head, don't I? No, it's a bread thing. That's fine. What? What's happening? What is going on? Can I go in you and die? No, I can't. Okay. You must be the head of this thing, right? Okay, let's put you on here. Maybe not. You're bread. Okay. Um. Okay, you're lit. And what? What? Where? What? What? oven and
everyone in the chat is smarter than me, and I'm not okay with that. What is happening? Uh... Nope! I'm hauling ass. I found a picture. Hey, a picture. Look, it's... A the house was a trap. Children would be co uh, No, they... No, 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 no. That is not okay. That is not right. That is a lie. There are... Fuck this game. Fuck this game. She would take us to the forest to die, but we would leave a trail to find our way back home. One time we got very lost. That's not real. That is not real. That is Hansel and Gretel. This is he is confusing his memories of an evil stepmother with Hansel and Gretel. Hansel and Gretel. Han <laughs> Fucking shit! What the fuck? Am I not dead? What the fuck? What the fuck is happening? I don't think I was supposed to fall. Wait, what? What is happening? Save me, tiny boat. Save me. Okay, um... What is this game? What is, what is going on? Shit's on fire, yo. Okay, uh, this is okay. We're we're back. We're we're back from outer space. You should have seen that look upon your face. We're good. We got this. We are going through bridge. Hansel Gretel, metaphors, brain punching, it's all good. We got this. <laughs> I don't like this game. <laughs> yeah, Dr. Batman would not be afraid of this shit. Thank you for pointing that out. What are you? Oh, it's a candy striper. It's it's a it's a pole. It's it's the, it's crest toothpaste. I don't what? Okay. Um. Hi. When your consciousness is in another's subconsciousness, your psyches will inevitably intermingle. Just as the client's mind can affect you, you will see parts of yourself reflected in the mind of the client. Tread lightly and tread carefully. Why am I thinking of candy canes? Okay, whatever. Sure, fine. Hello, client's brain. You have thought of awful things. What are you thinking of now? Eh, nope, not a thing you're thinking of. What is this? That's not a thing. Okay, moving on. Ew. Oh, 
Bird's not singing. This is a thing we talked about, right? This is a metaphor. Dead bird. Fucking Tim Burton sound effects. God damn it, Danny Elfman. What the fuck? At Neurostalgia, we take great measures to ensure our neuroprober safety as best we can. However, you are about to proceed through a highly dangerous area that you must face alone. If the client's subconscious becomes too volatile, you will be automatically removed from this area of the mind and taken to a safer area of the mind. Use this as an opportunity to collect yourself. When oh, ready, we are in the... We are deep in a heart of uh, Hansel and Gretel imagery here. ...that has taken root in the client's subconscious. I am... I was bitten by an animal in my sleep. That might be true, actually. That might be a thing. What is this? What? <sighs> Fucking Hansel and Gretel witch hunters. What the fuck? It was the worst birthday ever. Okay. Found it. Found your birthday. What the f- Nailed it! Okay. Uh, yep, worst birthday ever. Got it. Nailed it. That's probably true. Sup. not finished Among the Sleep yet. I left that shit off where scary things were chasing me because I'm a wuss. There are no mellow swan boats in Among the Sleep. Hello. What's up here? Hello, picture. We were last, but we found a house that looked nice. We were lost. Okay. That might be true, actually. Have we found all the photos yet? Is this ten photos? Oh, thank God! Okay. Uh, ten photos that are real. Rabbit stew must be true. Can I have the twin sister? How do I, like, how do 
I set these things? Save me from coming dinner. Fire is possibly true. Worst of the ever is true. Bit by an animal is probably true. Forced to die is probably not true. Trap. Eh, I don't know. How do I set these things? Um. I'm gonna try. Let's see if I can figure this out. Okay. Mill row, that's not working. Uh. Hmm. Uh. What the hell is this game? So Googling Nevermind only brings up Nirvana. That's lovely. Okay, uh, let's see. How do you choose pictures? Click the squares. Okay, let's try clicking squares. Uh, yes, squares not happening. Okay. Uh, can't drag shit, of course, because that would be too easy. While neural probing, you will encounter objects that look like photographs. This is how your consciousness interprets the concrete memory moments it finds within the client's psyche. Typically, there are about 10 of these memory photos found in each psyche. The mind can hold on to only so much. You'll find that half okay. of these photos present an actual moment Start related with the to the worst trauma. Birthday, the other half tend to be false by memories created bites. by the okay, client's conscious it. mind. It will ultimately be up to you I to believe determine you. which are which. So let's start with worst More birthday. Go to the middle row of things. You fucking game. God damn it. Oh, let's hit escape and see. Let's save progress. Uh, I'm assuming I save progress. Handbook. Uh, neuroprobing. Puzzles. Neuro mapping. Uh, bullshit. Recording progress. Moving. That's not true. That's not what I want. Okay, this is what I need. Um, this is useless. God damn it. Okay. Uh, click cake photo. Click Westmost Empty Square. Yes! Thank you! Oh my god! You are awesome! Thank you so much! Uh... Animal bite. Okay, this is working, this is working, this is working! Keep it going. Maybe rabbit stew? And, uh... Maybe hated? And fire. Let's try it. What? Not right, not That's right. That's not the story of this client's trauma. Try again. Okay, uh, Think hard uh, about the clues you saw along the way. Hmm. Let's solve this thing, shall we? Huh. 
Uh, okay, uh, uh, uh. Huh. Uh, okay, uh, ooh, uh, so, let's see, in with fire. Middle rabbits. Uh, then stepmother hate. Uh, Hansel and Gretel. Um, Take a moment and focus. Hmm. Solve this shit and then end this damn game. We got this. We're gonna solve this damn thing. Yes! Yes! Oh. oh my god. It's all rushing back to me. It's so awful and I don't want to remember, but yes, I now know the face of my demon. Oh. My sister and I we were taken out into the woods by my stepmother. Uh, Doctor for one of Brock, night brain punch fist walks. man. We'd usually trauma way back healer. By a trailer, MD. Whatever we could grab before the walk, uh, marbles, pieces of paper, even pebbles. However, one night, she took us deep, deep into the woods. We brought some bread to leave a trail of crumbs, but all the forest creatures must have eaten them. We were lost, so lost. We tried to find our way back, but it was so dark, and we were in a very strange part of the woods. We were lost for days, hungry and tired. We finally found a house and were so hopeful that someone might be able to help us. That house, though, that house was no ordinary house. It 
looked like this is not real man like what the hell are you talking about something off about it we shouldn't have gone in but we did oh they went in for lost children like us there was a woman in the house who would fatten her prisoners up and try to eat them, and that was going to be our fate. This is not real. What the hell are you talking I about? Was first, she tricked me into getting close to the oven, and before I knew it, I was inside. If it weren't for my clever sister Gretel pulling me out in time, I would have been burned alive. We escaped that house and found our this way home. This is a home. dumb trial. After that. Things started to get better. Our awful stepmother passed away, and my family came into some wealth. I guess... I guess we just forgot about those events. Well, okay then. How could you live with those images and memories inside your mind? Then again, they were always there. The old woman still torturing us beyond memory, beyond time. However, I can now confront my past, confront this throng. Thank you. It is better to know than not to know. Well, this is certainly a game. Okay, yeah, I got you. You're, you're. Maybe I saved your brain. Okay. Uh, yep. Brain solved. Fix your brain. Punch the cancer. It's all good, man. We're, we're solid. Yep. What? Okay, that's certainly a bathroom. Sure, why not? Yep. Yep. Fix the brain. You guys see that? Yep. I punched the cancer. It's all good. Saved uh, Hansel. Hansel. Hans. Wait, oh, that's where I came in. Hansel. I'm going back to my room. I can't go to my room. Fuck this game. Whatever. Yeah, these are people who made this game. This, oh god, it's Alan Moore. Holy shit. What the fuck? Oh my god, this is depressing. <laughs> ah, it's the guy who made the jump to conclusions game from Office Space. What is this? Wow. Okay, sure. You're awesome. There we are! Yep. That's what I'm looking for. Dr. Brock Zapfist. Oh, and in this moment of zen, let us end this game of Nevermind and pick something else. Dr. Brock Zapfist. It's all good. Yep, call it a day. Yep, that is the best option ever. Calling it a day.